love to play with food. So summer rolls are a great way to get kids involved in the kitchen. Once you have all the vegetables cut up and your fillings prepared and ready to go, get everyone around the table to start rolling. So we have two carrots sliced up into matchstick sizes, about five or six centimetres in length. Sliced out snow peas in length. Sliced out cucumber, a little bit bigger than the matchsticks, but the same length, five or six centimetres. Really roughly chopped the mint leaves. There's still quite big chunky leaves there. And as fine as I can, I've sliced the shallot. The omelette I've just sliced into the length that I want my rice paper roll to be. To cook the rice noodles, I just place them in some boiling water and turn the heat off straight away. Stir them with a fork and then in a couple of minutes they will have softened and then I drain them. Roughly chop them with a knife to make it easier to put them on the roll. Then I've mixed in a little bit of sweet chilli sauce. Okay, here we are rolling the summer rolls. I've just popped my rice paper in the water. This water is warm. I'm going to leave the rice paper in there for about five seconds. Don't worry if it's still a bit hard as it's going to continue to soften. And then lay it down on the board. You don't want to leave the rice paper in there too long. It will overcook and when you go to roll it, it will split. Now I place my filling, a little bit of noodles, make a nice log shape. So this is the shape we want our rolls to be and some of our lovely fresh fillings. Now you can use lots of other veggies with this as well. Capsicum, tinned baby corn, other different types of herbs, coriander, whatever you like. A little bit of omelette as well. Prawn is also good, a little bit of Leftover roast chicken, perhaps. Now we just pick up the end with my thumb and my forefinger and roll it over the top of the filling. Now I'm going to just tug it back a little bit just to pull the filling nice and firm and fold my edges over. Again, being gentle with the rice paper. You don't want to split it, but at the same time you want to pull the filling nice and tight. And now we're just going to keep rolling. Gently tugging back to make sure it's nice and tight until it's all rolled up. And there we go, a beautiful summer roll. Summer rolls are best had on the day that they are rolled. The rice paper is nice and soft, but they are okay the next day and in that case they do make a great filling in a lunch box. Os nossos corpos giram como helicópteros.